assisted living. Joan watches her mother, a tight fist of a woman, in a twin set and pearls. Red lipstick has bled into the wrinkles of her upper lip. Your father, her mother says with a jerk of her head, is an idiot. Joan stands, gathers their cups from the square kitchen table, and carries them to the sink. Her mother's lips left their angry imprint on the rim of her cracked world's best mom mug. Joan puts the milk in the fridge. The air is cool on her face. She never thinks to take her coat off when she visits. He forgot my prescription, her mother says, arms spread wide. Drove to the store and came back empty-handed. Mom, Dad's not even supposed to be driving. Oh, don't put that one in the dishwasher, her mother says. Her slippers whisper across the linoleum. He dropped it. She grabs for the mug Joan washes. It's cracked and, yes, Mom, it's okay. Accidents happen. Joan looks at her father. His lips twitch upward. Does he hear what she's saying? Dad, call me. Joan holds a phone like an ear, ear to a, holds her hand like a phone to her ear. No driving. She pantomimes steering, wondering if it's deafness or simply passive defiance. Her father stares out the window across the street. The apricot orchard, once an enchanted forest where Joan in a red cape rode bareback on magical creatures, is now a big box store that pulls in bargain hunters from neighboring cities. Joan tried to persuade her parents to sell and move into town and assisted living, but her mother refused. Thanks for the coffee, Joan says. She hugs her brittle mother and bends to kiss her father's cheek. He smells of bay rum. <laughs> Bye, Dad. His smile is so weary, her heart clenches quick like a fist. She squeezes his shoulder. Her high school picture hangs on the wall above him, a smooth-skinned girl with lights in her eyes. You're going already, her mother asks. Yes, Danny will be home by now. Can't that boy take care of himself? Night. Not quite, Mom. Lately, he's wearing her out with his teenage derision, his tempers and moods, his recent arrest for stealing vodka. He does battle with the world. Steve gets the worst of it. He's the brick wall their son bashes up against, while Joan is the buffer in the house. She grabs her purse, fighting the urge to run for the door. Her mother stands on the porch, waving, something like panic in her eyes. Joan speeds off slides the windows down, sucking in the cold. It looks like rain. She's low on gas. <laughs> she'll, talk, she'll have to talk to Donnie, Danny when she gets home. His teacher called her at work again. He's so much smarter than this, he said. Joan laughed, a snide sound that surprised her, and said, aren't we all? She turns onto her narrow street, surprised to see Steve's car in the driveway. Then she remembers his text, meeting canceled. She stares at her house, but has no more capacity for friction, and whips the car around. Wind whistles at the window. Pushing the cart up one aisle, down the next, nothing tempts her. She consults her list, eggs, butter, bread, something for dinner. Her phone rings. You said you were going home, her mother starts in. What? Can't hear. Joan crumples the shopping list over the mouthpiece. Static, then hangs up, shushing her guilt. She chooses a chocolate cake, remembers milk. Driving home, she turns off the news. What can she do about America's decline or unrest in the Middle East? Rain beats on the roof as the wipers swish. When her car begins to sputter, she remembers too late she needs gas and coaxes the stuttering car off the road into the shelter of tall maples. She picks up her phone, four bars. The street is empty. The wind emancipates falls left over leaves. She watches them sail and puts the phone down. The shivering leaves spill rain on the car, down the windshield, it pools on the hood. She thinks of the cake, pulls it from the bag, sets it on the dash, then slides a hanger from her husband's dry clean shirts and carves a generous slice. The parking ticket she got that morning becomes her plate, more expensive than her good china. She takes a bite and remembers there is milk. Thank you.